The monologue I will be presenting is from The Normal Heart by Larry Kramer. I am taking care of more victims of this epidemic than anyone else in the world. We have more accumulated test results, more data, more frozen blood samples, more experience. How can you not fund my research or invite me to participate in yours? A promising virus has already been discovered. In France. Why are we being told not to cooperate with the French? Why are you refusing to cooperate with the French? Just so you can steal a Nobel Prize? Your National Institutes of Health received my first request for research money two years ago. It took you one year just to print up application forms. It has taken you two and a half years since my first reported case just to show up here and take a look. The paltry amount of money you are making us beg for from the four billion dollars you are given each and every year won't come to anyone until only God knows when. Anyway, you add all this up, it is an unconscionable delay and has never, never existed during any other health emergency during this entire century. While something is being passed around that causes death, we are enduring an epidemic of death. Women have been discovered to have it in Africa where it is clearly transmitted heterosexually. It is only a question of time. We could all be dead before you do anything. You want my patients? Take them. Take them! Just do something for them! You're fucking right. I'm imprecise and unfocused. And you are all idiots. The song I will be singing an excerpt from is Home from Beauty and the Beast written by Alan Menken. What I'd give to return to the life that I knew lately And to think I complained of that poor provincial town Is this home? Am I here for a day or forever? Shut away from the world until who knows when. Oh, but then, as my life has been altered, once it can change again. Build higher walls around me, change every lock and key. Nothing lasts. Nothing holds all of me. <laughs>